Hey y'all, welcome back to the garage. Welcome back to the channel and don't mind me. I am really sick from like here up. Down here, fine, here up. Sick as can be. Um, matter of fact, all of us were sick. And not only that, but we've been dealing with a ton of audio issues so we haven't got a whole lot of footage up but I'm gonna kind of clip a bunch of stuff in here cause I don't know, I just ain't feeling real hot today, but let me show you some new stuff. So I kind of changed up the spacing and the stuff I have on the walls. I put in a whole bunch of new lamps. We put in a lift and oh, I got by without that for so long, but. And I actually got this lift off of Amazon. I'm gonna put a link to it down below. I got it at a really cheap price. It was $2,500 delivered to the door. I put that up hmm, 80% by myself with nothing but a cherry picker. And then these guys showed up and helped me get it all finished up. And I'll tell you what, having a lift in your shop, what an absolute game changer. It is, it is. It just makes life so much easier in here. Uh, rearranged a little bit of the art on the walls over here. But and we did decorate the crapper over here in the other side of the garage. Well, we got a new blasting cabinet. We were just in the middle of putting that together, but frankly, last night, we all felt terrible. And we were like, you know what? We're done, we're going home. But got a nice 65 Mustang pony car, uh, GT350 clone. There is a 55 Chevrolet over here. And you guys have probably seen this in the post, but that is a 70 Plymouth Roadrunner. One of very few convertibles made of this color. It is all still a numbers matching car and we are super excited to get this thing put together for this guy. 70,000 original miles. A beautiful car. Truly. I mean, I could run around it twice, but it is a beautiful car. <laughs> you can't car. beat the Roadrunner accent. Yeah. Beautiful. It is a... So if the Marine Corps has muddy fuckers and the Army has muddy fuckers and blue falcons, did y'all have Jodies? Yeah, we had Jodies. My best friend got Jodied when we were overseas. <laughs> <laughs> What's a Jody? Oh, Jodied your wife while you were overseas. <laughs> so if you're a little confused about that conversation earlier, you may have picked up on that Hobbs was in the Army. And I was in the Marine Corps, so we're obviously better. But, but we were making a comparison on as to what is still the same because there's obviously by the gray and the lack thereof of gray <laughs> no gray yet that there's some generations between our years of service so that's what we were talking about you're not in this conversation right freaking civvies <laughs> Uh, over here on this 55, um, so this has got a lot of the same problems that the 57 had, just a lot of running issues. 57 outside, let the customer know this is all completely done. Look how nice and clean, oh, that felt great. Look how nice and clean that turned out. Yep, the wide body Corvette is back. We're gonna finish setting the ride height on this. Do a couple other things on it. Uh, I think we're gonna do some exhaust work. We may add a little bit of carbon to it, but uh, the wide body is back and all oh, those wheels look good. That was a lot of work to get those wheels right on this car. 
So I just got my stuff kind of scattered. Got the black vet parked over there. I gotta pull that back inside. I got something going on with my with my AFR gauge. It's going all freaky wobbly on me. But uh, anyhow, guys, I appreciate you tuning in today as sick as I am and listening to me ramble and give you some updates on what we got going on here at the shop. Besides, we're just really busy, really busy. But uh, appreciate y'all tuning in. Be sure to hit that like button, share the video, oh, and subscribe. We will see you next time.